Hey, what is going on everybody? It's your favorite introvert here and today we're not doing an unboxing but we are going to go over the five steps you should take with your first or new drone before flying. Let's get into it. All right, I know I have the DJI Mavic Pro Alpine Wide Edition, but this basically goes for all intelligent drones out there. It could be your DJI's, it could be your Altels, any type of intelligent drone out there. These five steps that you should take will apply to any drone manufacturer out there. I just happen to have a DJI product. So let's get on with it. First thing you're gonna do when you're opening the box and you're doing your review, is you're going to want to ensure that you have all the parts and accessories that were advertised in the kit. You're also going to want to go through and make sure all the pieces function as they should. There's no broken parts. And basically that you got a perfectly working drone. That's going to be step number one. Step number two is read your manuals. Whether it's your first drone or a new unfamiliar drone, reading your manual will provide all the necessary information for you to have a successful first flight and many additional flights for your future. Step number three, make sure batteries are fully charged before taking to the skies. The batteries come in a sleep state to ensure battery longevity and health. Charging them for the first time activates the intelligent batteries and brings them to life. Draining a battery below factory specs will decrease the life of the battery and runs the risk of damaged cells or even fire. So take care of your batteries. These intelligent batteries are super safe when you use them properly and you don't fly them below factory specs. Again, you will read those manuals. I'm not sure which drone you guys are flying, so read your manuals to find out the proper specs and the battery state not to fly below. Updating firmware. Update your drone's firmware after charging your batteries. This ensures two things. One, that you have enough battery life to install necessary firmware updates. This process can take a while. And two, that your batteries get their first full charge and are fully activated. This is really important for you guys to ensure that your batteries are fully charged because these cells are memory cells. And if you charge them fully the first time, they're going to remember that charge and they're going to have 100% capacity for the longer life of the battery. So keep that in mind and update your firmware. And last but not least, number five, the fifth step. Calibrate your drone sensors. Your drone is a very intelligent piece of gear and to ensure safe operations and a happy drone pilot, calibrating your sensors is a cheap form of insurance prior to flight. Calibrating sensors like IMU and Compass will ensure a rock solid drone and a less nervous you. So remember guys to calibrate your drone when you're out the field or when you're first taken in the backyard for a flight. This will get your drone calibrated and used to your surroundings and it also calibrates it for your first flight. So I hope that helps you guys out. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Provide in the comments what you think should be some additional steps that you think I left out. That's going to wrap it up for this video. Thanks for watching.